Director of the Training Ma Manager for Talent Play. This is Tony Swain, Director of Training and Education. And today, we are going to go over a football workout. Since the Super Bowl is this weekend, what would, what would be better than, than to work on explosive power and improve our performance on the football field? Now, we want the Giants to win. The power play easier, so we're rooting for the Giants. Of course. I mean, I'm from, I'm from New York, so got to root for the Giants. And also, you know, we started this uh, kind of wearable user of like so. This, this week's workout is for Lon Record and the Villanova Wildcats. Go Wildcats, a basketball team. So, Lon, appreciate it. Guys, send us your soft goods. We'd be more than happy to wear it and then uh, promote you guys during the workout. So, we have five exercises today to increase power on the football field. The first one is going to be called an ankle explosion. So, this exercise is going to work on lower body power, specifically through lower leg muscles and that ankle complex. Settings for this workout are going to be 35 hertz for 30 seconds for each exercise. So for this, for this exercise, we're going to have a, a slight bend in the knee just to make sure we get the vibration out of, out of our head. And then we're going to explode up through the ankles and continually repeat that motion as fast as we can while controlling our form. Good. So, we're going to do this for a duration of 30 seconds. By then, you should feel a nice burn in those lower leg muscles. Don't forget to put a little bit more air into it anytime you're doing some fly back tricks on the leg. Exactly. Perfect. Second exercise is going to be a lateral shuffle. So, so you can hop on the, on the power plate. Same settings as the previous exercise, 35 hertz, high for 30 seconds. Slight bend in the knee. And we're just going to shuffle to the side about an, an inch or two, going as quickly as possible but while maintaining form. So now we're going to be working on our, our lateral power and stability. There we go. Our third exercise is going to be plyo X push ups. So we're going to have three different hand positions. And you're literally, they're going to, they're going to make an X. So we're going to start with right hand forward, left hand back. In a push-up position, make sure you activate those glutes, keep that core tight, explode, come, come down, explode up, let's move to neutral hand position, come down, explode up, perfect, and alternate your hands, there you go, left, left hand up, right hand back, perfect, come back, back to neutral position, and repeat, 35 hertz high for 30 seconds. Our fourth exercise is going to be a lunge to chest press. So this one we're actually not going to be on the power plate. We're going to be off of the machine, utilizing our pro motion cable. And we're going to pull up, pull the resistance up to high. Now if this is if this is too much for you, you can definitely use it on a low setting, but if you're strong and you have some, some upper body and lower body power, we want it to be on high. So first we're going to lunge to the right and explode with the chest press with the right leg forward, then straight out in front with the right leg forward and then to the left, right leg forward. Next, we're gonna come back to the left side with the left leg forward, straight ahead, left leg forward, and to the right, left leg forward. So we're really working at all angles, working on our lower body power and our upper body power with that movement. Our fifth exercise is gonna be our, our standard power clean, so that we're gonna be able to get the benefits of the vibration and really utilize these, these promotions. Grab, grab, grab those cables, come, come down into, into a squat, make sure to maintain neutral, neutral spine, core tight, explode up, catch, catch in slow motion, perfect. Come back down and let's do it one more time. Good. So this is a great exercise if we're, if we're looking to increase our power throughout our body from, from head to toe. Our sixth exercise is really my favorite. This is great for linemen, this is great for linebackers, anyone that needs power through the lower body, power through the hips, and also the upper body. So we're actually going to start off in a push-up position. This is going to be a three-point explosion through through the chest, through the legs, and also through the hips. Now Brett, it's been over 20 years since I played football, so bear with me on this one. It's, that, that, that's fine. <laughs> now, if, you know, so this is actually, there's, there's three components to this move. So we'll, we'll actually walk through all three and then combine them all. So the first one's going to be just apply a push-up. So apply a push-up, perfect. And then from there, we're going to do apply a push-up.
push-up, and we're going to jump onto the plate at the same time. Perfect. And then we're going to stabilize in that squat. So we really have kind of three things we're working on. We're working on our upper body power with that push-up. Then we're working on our power through the hips. And then our, our lower body stability and, and strength in the lower legs by maintaining that squatting position. So whether you're that, that lineman coming out that three-point stance or that linebacker that's right here, you really need some explosion upwards. It's going to be a great move for you. So hope you enjoyed that workout. Tough. And, and go Giants. Go Giants.